Good day, class! How are you today? I hope you're doing great. This is Teacher Bim Bim and welcome to PLE 9 Cookery Quarter 3. For today's video, we're going to feature the types of sandwiches. Previously, I have discussed the two classification of sandwiches, namely cold sandwiches and hot sandwiches. Today, I will discuss the types of sandwiches. We have number one. Regular hot dog sandwiches. Simple hot sandwiches consist of hot fillings, usually meats, but sometimes fish, grilled vegetables, or other hot items between two slices of bread. They may also contain items that are not hot, such as a slice of tomato or raw onion on a hamburger. Number two, hot open face sandwich. Open face sandwiches are made by placing butter or unbuttered bread on bread on a serving plate, covering it with hot meat or other filling and topping with a sauce, gravy, cheese, or other topping. This type of sandwich is eaten with a knife and fork. Number three, grilled sandwiches. Grilled sandwiches are also toasted sandwiches. Are simple sandwiches that are buttered on the outside and browned on the griddle in a hot oven or in a panini grill. Sandwiches containing cheese are popular for grilling. Number four, deep fried sandwiches. Deep fried sandwiches are made by dipping sandwiches in a beaten egg and sometimes in bread crumbs and then deep fry. Number five, field roll, focaccia, or pita bread. Flavor breads served with deep slice sadillas and burritos. Number six, open face sandwiches. Open sandwiches make use of one kind of bread with a filling on top. The slices of white bread can be cut into squares, triangles, or rounds. Butter is spread lightly on top, and pieces of cheese or meat fillings are arranged and garnished attractively like that make use of biscuits, cookies, or toast instead of using breads. Number seven, regular cold sandwiches. A plain sandwich is made up of two slices of bread, preferably a day-old bread, toasted if desired, and on which butter can be readily spread. Its crust may be or may not be removed depending upon your preference. Butter, mayonnaise, or a prepared sandwich spread may be used as lining to prevent the bread from absorbing moisture from the filling. Moreover, it ensures that the bread and the filling will stick together. Number 8. Pinwheel Sandwiches Pinwheels are made of bread cut lengthwise about 3 inch thick. Fresh cream bread is preferable because they are easy to roll and will not crack. Trim crust and flatten long slices with rolling peas. Spread bread with softened butter or margarine and your choice of any smooth filling like cream cheese, marmalades, cheese pimiento, peanut butter, jams, and jellies. Smooth filling is ideal for pinwheel sandwiches because they do not have bulk and can be spread thinly. Roll bread like a jelly roll. Number 9. Pea Sandwiches Pea sandwiches are small fancy sandwiches made from light, delicate ingredients and bread that have been creamed or grass and may be made ahead of time and frozen. They are often cut into fancy shapes, squares, rectangles, and oblongs add to the variety. Fillings and spreads can be the same as those for canapes. Number 10. Multi-decker sandwiches are made with two or more slices of bread or rolls split into more than two pieces and with several ingredients in the filling. The club sandwich is a popular multi-decker sandwich made of three slices of toast and filled with sliced chicken, mayonnaise, lettuce, tomato, and bacon and cut into four triangles. Number 11. Rough Road Sandwiches Rubs are sandwiches in which the fillings are rough like Mexican burrito in a large, large tortilla of similar lab bread. They may be served whole or cut in a half if large. That's it for today's video. I hope you learned something new. Once again, this is Teacher Bim Bim and hope to see you soon. Bye-bye!